Right. Yeah. Hey everybody, this is Ron Gadget Man. Today is August the 16th of 2011, and we're I'm back at home from Cottonwood, Arizona. And uh, today we just did this this beautiful little Suburban 1997 model, 7.4 liter engine, and it's owned by a man named Dave. And uh, his son actually brought him over here today. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to let them introduce themselves and tell their story, and uh, then we'll just take it from there. All right. So uh, let's see. Uh, let's, let's start with you, Jeff. Right. I'm Jeff McCann. I found about found out about the uh, Gadget Man group on mm -hmm. YouTube, and a friend showed it to me, and I turned my dad on to it here, and we're going to give her a test on the Suburban with a 7.4 liter, it's a 454 engine, Right. and uh, Ron just worked his magic on it, put the groove on mm -hmm. it, and took care of some vacuum problems, uh -huh. and we test drove it, and mm -hmm. this thing's already peppy and got mm -hmm. a lot more get up, so we're going to do an mm -hmm. MPG test on it. Mm -hmm. See what kind of mileage gains right, we get. Well, we'll look for something great. All right, so this, th this is his vehicle, right? It's his vehicle, uh -huh. and he's looking to keep it and save some gas mileage. All right, so so why don't you introduce yourself there, Dave? Yeah, I'm Dave McCann. And, uh, where, where do you live, Dave? I live in uh, right up here in northern Phoenix. Yeah. Came from, uh, just came down from Washington State and Iowa, and then Malibu, California, you know, all over. Uh -huh. Have this uh, nice Suburban, but was thinking of selling it because it's a gas guzzler. Uh-huh. And uh, getting about, I don't know, 10, 11, 12 miles an hour, gallon. Uh -huh. And we just took it out after you installed this and drove it around for four, three or four miles. And boy, it jumps at the, it's a stop sign, jumps right out. Uh -huh. it seems to have more, a lot more uh, pep to it. Uh -huh. And uh, we're going to take it back and run it, run it hard and see what we get. <laughs> we're looking for, oh, maybe up to 20 miles a gallon. Yeah, so well, forward to it. if your luck holds, yeah, <laughs> we'll, we never know, but we're going to find out, yeah, right? It's already running a lot better, so oh, well, good. he wants to keep it, uh -huh. so this will help us get the mileage down on it. All right. So, so, so how long have you been driving this, Dave? I've been driving it for about two years. All right. And uh, so, so you know, all, you saw what I did today. Yeah, you know, just, I saw what you did. And just did the groove and corrected some vacuum issues, right? I stood right there and watched you do the whole thing. All right, so, so let me ask you, was it worth the money you paid? Pardon? Was it worth the money you paid for it? Well, I can't help but believe I'll have my money back uh, within a few months. <laughs> well, we'll hope so. Yeah. Uh, just per, just the performance gains alone, though, because because you know we can never predict the the mileage gains. But how about the performance values? Would you say the money you spent for the groove was worth it? Oh, I'm positive. I went back and checked the exhaust, and uh, there's no color coming out of there, no smell. <laughs> no just, smell. Just a little bit of heat. <laughs> so, well, that's pretty cool. That's good. But you got. You got anything else you want to tell everybody out there in Gadget Man Land? Well, you I'm, guys? I'm uh, convinced that uh, even though I'm retired, I think I better get back in the business and help promote this thing because <laughs> I'm sold on it. Oh, wonderful. That's good news. You're welcome aboard. Okay. All right. see, see how hard that is to be, be a Gadget Man? You got a deal. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Hey, you too, right? Yeah, I've got several vehicles lined up to have modified by Ron, and I'm looking forward to looking at some good mile yeah. per gallon games. Oh, we we'll look forward to it. Anything else? Well, the only thing I want to say is that uh, we got to work every way we can to get back some of the money that's being uh, <clears throat> uh, taken from us. This is <laughs> yeah. one of the first places to start on gasoline well, savings. I, I think it's, you know they've been using it for about a hundred years to manipulate the whole society. So, all right, so. So guys, once again, you see that a little groove can make a big difference, and uh, obviously more people are pleased to see the smile on his face. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. So I'm going to say God bless y'all richly and warmly. You go to GadgetManGroove.com right now and click on Get Grooved, and we'll get the process started. If you happen to be in the Arizona or in the Phoenix area, uh, get a hold of me, and you can come over, and maybe we'll make you the next star on Gadget Man Camera Land. <laughs> right. So again, smile for a stranger today. You will both be glad you did, and I'll see y'all later. Bye-bye.